Comet breeze, the mesa to the western skies With the sound of a thousand cattle drive A chosen few would see the light And fight the wrong with right Up on the mesa Jezebel, this is the fourth pair you've tried on. <laughs> you know, she just wants to look her best. It ain't every day that Cowtown gets a new school, Marm. Yep. I was just coming from the telegraph office. The new school, Marm's due on the afternoon stage. Now that's a mite peculiar. Those gents are working mighty early. Yep. Let's, uh, give them a hand. That's the assay off the safe. Dad, blast that Moo Montana! Simmer down, Sheriff. What's got you so riled? The marshal just busted the warthog gang I hired to rob the assay office. <sighs> Ain't no decent bad guys left west of the Fracos. You got a point there, Terrible. The Marshal always seems to be one up on us. We need some outlaws who can slip in and out of town without being noticed. Uh, but who? Whoa. Sorry, Mayor Baloney. We were just playing. Keep your eyes open next time. No good, varmints. Can't wait till the new school marm gets here and keeps them out of our hair. Why, Sheriff, you need to be nice to those young'uns. They're our new gang. <laughs> That's plum crazy. Those calves live by the code of the West. They'll never do nothing bad. Not unless someone they admire told them to. But first, I've got a job for the mask bull. What? I I'm not carrying nothing that enters the mass ball. Never know what might interest me. Pleasure, Miss Schoolmar. Ah! <laughs> Help! Signal flare, Cyclone. Stagecoach is in trouble. Ah! Hold up there, mass ball. Giddy up, Cyclone! Time to lighten my load. Apologies, ma'am. <laughs> Folks, y'all please welcome Miss Sarah Sheep, our new school mom. Morning, Miss Sheep. I'm so happy to be here in this beautiful little town. Something wrong, Dakota? Nope. Uh, as for you, ma'am. <laughs> oh, Dakota always said he appreciates a lady who could teach him something. Yeah. Like his old school marm. Yeah. He's got a special fondness for her considering she taught him everything he knows. Sure did. I'm allergic to them things. 
Be nice to Dakota, or you'll blow our skin. But I'll get over it. <laughs> well, anything I can do to help, you just let me know. You remind me of my first school marm. <laughs> I ain't lying. How oh, nice. Now, how about cock my baggage after the schoolhouse? Sure bet, Miss Sheep. <laughs> Today's assignment will be a field trip to the IC office. What's this mean, ma'am? The sum of the combination to the safe? Ah, uh, uh, that's arithmetic. <laughs> okay, get moving. I want this finished by sundown. Hey there, Cody. I figured Miss Sheep might need some more school books. Deputy Dakota, this homework is mighty strange. Hey, if Miss Sheep said do it, then you do it. You respect your elders. Yes, sir. Uh, Miss Sheep? <laughs> oh, not here. Well, I'd just leave the books. <laughs> so the combination of the safe is 3 plus 9 plus 5 equals 17. <laughs> Good. Uh, you can have the rest of the day off. I wonder where she's going in such a hurry. Look at look at all that gold. <laughs> We're gonna be filthy rich. <laughs> I'm gonna be rich. My but boss. <laughs> Here's your cut. Just keep those calves working. Yeah! You sure look pretty in that dress. <laughs> All right, shut up and start carrying. Robbed! We've been robbed! We've been robbed! Hey! We've been robbed! <laughs> this is too perfect. Uh, now for the calves' next assignment. Uh, have them find out the secret route Calamity Kate is using to send her gold shipment into town. <laughs> now how am I gonna get the calves to do that? Tell them it's uh, a geography lesson. Okie dokie. Uh -huh, that's a good plan. Uh -huh. Um... What's geography? <laughs> well, morning, youngins. How'd y'all like your new school marm? Not sure yet. She seems mighty strange. But Deputy Dakota sure taking a fancy to her. <gasps> you don't say. Don't think so. Maybe I'll mosey into town with my gold shipment this afternoon and have a look-see for myself. Be careful, Miss Calamity. They robbed the gold from the essay office this morning. Now, don't you worry, Carly. We're taking a secret route through Whispering Willa Gulch. <gasps> Whispering Willa Gulch? <laughs> you sure? Yes, ma'am. We even made a map. But I'm not sure we should have. What if the map fell into the wrong hands? Good thinking! <laughs> I'll see it stays in the right hands. <laughs> uh. <laughs> the mass bull! You're not getting this gold without a fight! You may be good with that lasso, Calamity Kate, but my partner has the drop on your driver. You don't want him to get hurt now, do you? Outlaws. <laughs> oh, yeah. Rocky, you hack into town and get the marshal. I'm gonna get my gold back from those sidewinders. <laughs> Skunk holler. So that's the mass bull's hideout. Well, 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 welcome, Calamity. You'll be staying a while. Get in there! 
<laughs> now, you disrest a spell till the masked bull decides what to do with you. And you just wait till Marshal Moo Montana gets a hold of you. Ooh, I'm so scared I forgot to laugh. <laughs> Well, well, howdy. I'm Calamity Kate. How'd you do? Sarah Sheep, the new school marm. You're the school marm? How come those varmints got you? I don't know. Well, don't be afeard. We'll get out of here. Why, Dakota? I thought I'd lost you. I mean, you're gone. Nope. I, uh, wrote a song for you. For me? I'm uh, <laughs> speechless. <coughs> a Coyote's Lament by Dakota Dude. Way down in Moo Mesa, where the sage bus does grow, where us coyotes yell. <laughs> Oh, sounds to me like a hound dog that sat on a prickly pear. Must be Dakota singing. <laughs> Marshal Moo, the masked bull stole the gold, and Miss Calamity Kate went after him. Colorado, saddle up the horses. We got some hard riding to do. Yippee I yo cow yay! <laughs> Jezebel! Now, how did that low-down mass bull know when Calamity's gold shipping was coming through? The map! I better ask Miss Sheep if she showed it to anyone. <laughs> Look, we got the dang gold. The school marm has one more job to do. To find out the location of the Golden Cud Mines Gold Depository, or else. Boot Hill Buzzard, we've been hoodwinked. Deputy Dakota, wait! Hey, now, not now, little buddy. I got to help move. <laughs> but I just found out something awful about the school marm. Hey, Ed, now you hold it right there, Cody. I won't hear nothing bad about Miss Sheep. But Dakota won't ever believe me. The masked bull said Boot Hill had one more job to do. Maybe us calves can help him. For your next assignment in, in geography, um, that's geography, ma'am. When I want your help, <laughs> I'll ask for it. Now, I want you all to find the gold depository for the golden cud mine. That's easy, ma'am. Everybody knows that. They do? Sure. The mine puts the gold into Fort Sox on the west slope of Buffalo Back Mountain. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's enough school for today. <laughs> Class dismissed. Cody, Fort Sox is a broken down cavalry fort. There's no gold there. I know that, Carly. We've been buffaloed, but I got us a plan that can catch those scoundrels. I ain't never heard of no gold depository up here. If it's a secret, they're not likely to tell you about it now, are they? Oh, never crossed my mind. Here they come. Get ready. Hold it. Hey, what is it, boss? Appears we have a surprise party waiting for us. <laughs> I love parties. <laughs> no! No! Ah! Ow, what happened? Uh-oh, we just fell into a heap of trouble. <laughs> Well, that was a cold trail. Rest assured, boys. We'll find the masked varmint. Reckon I'll look in on my sheep. A oh, moo? Marshal Moo! Cody and the other two calves are gone. I found this note. Dear Marshal Moo, me and Jake and Carly have gone to ambush the masked bull at Buffalo Back Mountain. Sincerely, your deputy, Cody. P.S. The school marm is really Boot Hill Buzzard. He misspelled sincerely. 
If Cody went after the mass bull, he did a lot worse than that. <sighs> Miss Sheep's in trouble! That's not the, uh, <clears throat> the half of it. Buzzard! Double yep. I've been a fool. We've all been fools, Dakota. The crazy school assignments were just so the mass bull could rob our town. Dead gummit. That sounds like thunder. I reckon that comet Char is kicking up some of its peculiar weather. But right now, us heifers gotta get out of here. Hot diggity! There's the answer. Those mining tools. <clears throat> I hate to point out the obvious calamity, but those tools are over there and we're over here. Not for long, Sarah. Not for long. Calamity in the school marmots, huh? Now, isn't that real convenient? Right. Turn them into critter fritters. <laughs> Miss Calamity! There's smoke! And it's coming from Skunk Holler! Smoke! Yep. Let's rodeo, boys! <laughs> <laughs> we'll never get out of here alive! <coughs> we sure won't if we stop trying. Why, you have made an electromagnet. <laughs> now gone right. I loved science when I was in school. <laughs> come on, come on. <laughs> Hurry! <laughs> Give it up, Maspo. I'm taking you in. Not unless you can walk around with holes in you. Nice to see you boys are getting your bath. And it's not even Saturday night. <laughs> now, Dakota, I, I didn't mean nothing. It weren't my idea. Sha! <laughs> that ought to hold you rattlesnakes. <laughs> Now let's find out who the mask bull really is. Marshal Moon, Miss Calamity and the school marm are in the shack. <coughs> Moo, there's no water to put out the fire. No! 
sell yourself, Cody. <laughs> this heifer's not ready for the frying pan yet. The masked bull. He's gone! Hmm. Well, Sheriff, I'd be obliged if you put these rascals in the calaboose. Well, I was planning on having the jail remodeled. Ah, oh, that's fine. We can wait. I changed my mind. Lock me up now, please, please. I'm sure I'm glad it wasn't you, Dakota. Was all head up about Miss Sheep. Welcome to Cowtown. Cody. I got something to say, boy. Yes, sir. Like it says in the code of the West, a cowboy is only wrong when he can't admit it. And I was wrong. I didn't pay you no never mind. I'm sorry, little partner. I'm right proud of you, Cody. You knew something was wrong, and you stuck with it. Thanks, Marshal Moo. But you should have waited for some help from the big folks instead of going off on your own. I'm sorry, Marshal. Oh, cheer up, Gaffbite. Have a sass, really. On me.